In a major step forward for U.S. missile defense, Lockheed Martin and the U.S. Army completed a crucial flight test of the PAC-3 Missile Segment Enhancement MSE, at the White Sands Missile Range in New Mexico on June 26, 2025. The test, announced on July 8, verified recent software updates and improvements to the missile's radar seeker systems, aimed at enhancing its ability to intercept airborne threats under simulated battlefield conditions. The PAC-3 MSE, developed by Lockheed Martin, is currently the most advanced interceptor integrated into the Patriot missile defense framework. Designed to outperform earlier versions, it features significant hardware enhancements, including a powerful dual-pulse solid rocket motor, that extend its reach beyond 60 kilometers and enable interceptions at altitudes up to 20 kilometers. This increased range and elevation coverage are essential for neutralizing threats such as high arc ballistic missiles and rapid approach targets. Agility is a key strength of the PAC-3 MSE. Its advanced maneuvering system, paired with real-time guidance from both onboard radar and ground-based control, enables the missile to make rapid adjustments mid-flight. This capability is critical when facing fast-moving or evasive threats like tactical ballistic missiles, drones, cruise missiles, rotary aircraft, and even advanced hypersonic weapons nearing impact. One of the test's focal points was the deployment of refined seeker algorithms embedded in the missile's active Caband radar system. These upgrades improve how the missile distinguishes actual threats from decoys or electronic countermeasures in congested airspaces. By enhancing its ability to detect and track specific targets in hostile environments, the PAC-3 MSE increases its effectiveness against swarm tactics and heavily jammed zones. Unlike older systems that relied on explosive fragmentation, the PAC-3 MSE employs a hit-to-kill method, slamming directly into its target to destroy it through sheer force. This direct impact technique is particularly effective against armored or stealthy projectiles, offering both increased lethality and reduced risk of unintended damage near populated zones. The interceptor has already proven its worth in active combat, having been deployed in real-world scenarios by the U.S. and allied militaries. Its presence in the arsenals of nations like Poland, Japan, Germany, Sweden, and South Korea speaks to its global strategic value and trustworthiness in joint defense frameworks. The June 2025 test validates not just the missile's improved tracking and targeting systems, but also Lockheed Martin's commitment to rapidly evolving the platform in line with modern threats. With software-based updates and scalable hardware improvements, the PAC-3 MSE is well-positioned to remain a linchpin in layered air defense networks for years to come. As aerial and missile-based dangers grow more sophisticated, the PAC-3 MSE stands out as a robust, adaptable solution for defending both military assets and civilian infrastructure from next-generation attacks.